What's up, people? Welcome back. Total OS today is Total Technology for Beginners because we all start somewhere. Well, I have some news for this week, some Linux Mint news. Uh, Linux Mint 17 will be released at the end of May. You will have a choice of four flavors, Cinnamon, Mate, uh, XFCE, and KDE. So take a look at that. Look for it probably at the end of May of this year. Of course, one of my polls, many of you suggested uh, Linux Mint for XP users. I agree wholeheartedly. All right, keeping in with um, Linux Mint news, let's going to take a look. The Mintbox 2, I guess, is now available in Europe. Um, CompuLab Mintbox 2. Okay, it says here now currently unavailable. I guess it's a big seller. Hey, it's Linux Mint. It's good stuff. Uh, third generation Intel Core i5 IV Bridge, dual core processor. A uh, five-year warranty, not bad, so definitely check that out. I'll have links below in the show notes. I'm assuming it's still available here uh, in the United States. So that is the Mint Box 2, of course, from Linux Mint. All right, let's see what else we have here. Uh, Lubuntu, the next one, the 14.04 version coming out, uh, I believe at the end of next month, April. For the first time, that is going to have an LTS support supported for five years. Uh, Lubuntu now has been out uh, three, four years now. I kind of lost track. But for the first time, this wonderful lightweight Linux distribution will have five-year support. This would be maybe one of my choices if you wanted to keep that old XP machine. Of course, XP expires April the 8th, uh, I believe. Lubuntu may be one of the choices for you to install if you wanted to keep that machine and keep it running versus, you know, throwing it away, maybe. All right, a couple more things. Um, if you haven't already, please vote for the latest poll. Would you buy a smartwatch? Looks like 75% uh, say new. Uh, you have about 10 days left to vote. And uh, would you buy a smartwatch? Uh, would I buy a smartwatch? Maybe. I'm not really sure. It would have to be something... I don't know, something I would use or wear every day. I don't really wear most of the watches I have now since I keep my cell phone on me. But I, I mean, I can see where a smartwatch might come in handy to keep track of texts and messages from you guys. So, yeah, I might, I might buy a smartwatch. I haven't decided yet. All right, and finally, uh, this weekend, March 29th, I believe, marks the four-year anniversary of the Total OS Today channel. Uh, thank you. It's been an enjoyable, completely pleasurable journey for, for me. Uh, I hope you guys have learned as much uh, for me, from me as I have learned from you uh, doing these wonderful type of um, tutorials, of course the podcast. It's been a complete joy and I hope to continue uh, doing more, of course, with your help. I will probably do a solo podcast on the four-year anniversary of Total OS Today you know, talk about the past, present, and the future of this channel. So once again, thank you for four years. It's been a lot of fun, to say the least. All right, I think that's it for this. Thank you so much for watching and listening. And as always, I will catch all of you sometime in the future.